since I'm here at Bags, guys. And the ladies just brought me some more tomatoes. I had her make me more drink because I want to get rid of that um, Western style medication. Guys, this is high blood pressure. And it, I think it's working well. So I take morning and uh, I take in, she said, when I first wake up and then when I go to sleep. But I have been taking it for around midday. And I asked her, was it okay? She said it's okay, but she just was saying morning, afternoon. But me, you know me, I got to do it right. Or at least I think it's right. <laughs> I hope it's working. I got to get some batteries to put in my blood pressure tester today to check it again. And I really haven't been having it up, so it's good. And they also just brought me some this out. This is so good when ladies cook here in Africa. Uh, it's from the wan juice uh, flour. And you use the leaves to cook, make sauce, all kind of stuff. Raheem and Rick and just ate some, what was y'all had? Some pinto beans or some black eyed peas? Uh, I just wanted that. Okay, it was good. Some black, black eyed peas with some chicken he had. And them dogs coming to get them bones. But anyway, I'll be right back, guys. So Raheem is getting him some B-Sap take to the house. He should have got a whole bag. But I just found out the name of this medicine. They said Kasala. 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 Kasala is good for blood pressure. And she did explain to me that you can take it three times a day. Especially if you, just, you have a headache. If you come on with a headache, take some of this, a shot of that, and you're good for the day, they say. And that, like I said, I haven't been having any headaches from that. Of my blood pressure, anyway. I need to take something. I'll be having all kind of headaches. Talk about something else kind of headache, guys. But anyway, yeah, we're gonna take care of that, Mr. Rick. You've been saying that for 30 years now? Oh, you still here? I didn't know you was filming. Mm. Oh, okay. Uh huh. <laughs> Casala. Casala and B sap. I love the B sap when they make it. That stuff is so good mm -hmm. with sauce and rice. And, but my, I use more of quinoa with mine. What are you running for? He keeps saying he's looking for drugs. Duh. Anyway, guys, that's what we're dealing with. And I will be right back at you. See, guys, the compost is working. They keep turning it now again. This is Miss Nadia from Nadi Digging. And we brought all the wood, cardboard, and all our scraps from home. Pineapples and all the other pomegranate seeds. Uh, Whatever, it's in here, guys. <laughs> What'd you say? Nothing. Oh my gosh, I didn't even record anything. Yes, but it's looking well. They're turning it now, so it is breaking down. And you can see, guys, how it is going up under there. You just got to keep it turned. Before you know it, we're going to have some good old uh, compost up in here, up in here. I just got to get into turning it more and wetting it. I would do it myself, but hey, I ain't no spring chicken like I used to be. Oh well, but it looks well. I'm not kidding, it is turning. I just got to get my tarp somewhere. Look how it's turning, guys. I can't believe how this is turning. I really honestly thought it wasn't going to turn, but it, I mean, you know, it is turning. It takes time, I guess, you know, let's get some of this over here. It's doing well and I am very impressed with it. Before you know it, we're going to be all right. What I think, I keep telling Rick, we think, I think maybe it'll work faster. I don't know. Take empty, maybe a couple of these here into one. And start over with just the fresh in one bin instead of keep putting the fresh on top. That's what I was trying to explain. But I guess they're not listening to me. And like I said, I can't do it because I'm not as young as I used to be. But hey, it is breaking down, which is good. I like the way it's breaking down. So it is good. And so maybe next week we'll do that. I have one bin. Oh, got this one. Yes, one bean combined and just put the fresh in one bean. You always want the fresh one in one bean 
and as it turns you can add it to the other one but you know this is just me i don't know if that's correct but it seems like it takes longer especially when they keep putting fresh on top but uh maybe they i guess they don't understand Cynthia, so it's okay I understand. Your phone never your phone needs to cool down yeah, that's our phones for you. Always like that, especially when I'm out here and the sun is beaming on it. But it looks well. It do, it is turning, so this is good. Once you look, where you get that from? That's the same one. Oh, I thought it was that right there. You laid it back down. It's right here. It's right here. Yeah. Yeah, it is. I can see it. It just need to. Do some more to it. You want the the uh what you call them? The port. No, I'm almost done with this one. Um, Y'all ain't getting to the bottom. All the way to the bottom. You see, it's all up there. That's good though. At least it is turning. I didn't think it was gonna turn this quick, but it is. It's too hard to get to the bottom. That's why you use the pitchfork. You want it? Yeah. Huh? Yeah. Okay, I'll be right back, guys. She wants the pitchfork. Where is it? I thought it was over there with you. Did you move it? Let me see. It's not in neither one of these beams. Where's the other Sal Salifa? Huh? Where, where's the other one like that? This. Where is that? No, no, no. This. Where's the other one? You don't see it, Nadia? Huh? Okay, well, she don't see it. I don't know what happened to it. No, it's not down there. I thought it was. I put it in the bin. Maybe she pulled it somewhere. But I'll be back, guys. Yeah, we did find the other pitchfork, but we know that down there, up, uh, all this is what's up under it. I believe once you do all that old switching and everything, flipping it and touch stirring it up, we on to something right here, guys. It's going to be going up on our my backyard plant. So once we end that house. That's what I'm gonna use. His is looking mighty good too. Ooh, it's really turning up in there. That is really nice. I must say it's really good. But we just gotta keep them from putting in paper. But it does look good right there. And very impressed with this. The way it's turning out. Thank you so much. Doing a great job. Yes, yes, yes. So I think we need to combine at least two to put the wet stuff in. I mean, this is good too, but we, you know, keep putting in the dry on top of this one, which is good too. But when you get, it's hard sometimes to get to that bottom. It's, uh, Looks good under there. Look at that, guys. This is some bad compost, guys. I must say it is. I have to say it again. I'm very impressed with the way it's turning out. I just got to get my tarps before rainy season so we can uh, put them on here. We got one more to go. See all the wet stuff we just brought from home is right here. Yes, how are you? Good, good, good. Hopefully, those things are breaking up too, so that is good to uh, pointy these things here. I thought it was going to take a long time to break up, but it's actually breaking up, guys. It's really soft. So, Rick did great creating this here. These 12 composts, I am very impressed. I've got to give him a gift for that. Let me figure out something. I don't know what the gift is. I can imagine what he would like for his gift to be. But anyways, I'm going to sign off. They out somewhere chasing the... There was one cow that got on today that I know of. 
and they're out chasing them. So I'm going to leave with this. It's time for us to go. Oh, they got Mr. Samuel coming. I thought he, he said he was sick, but he is here. Looks like that's him. Uh, I will see you guys later. It is the weekend, and we must go and enjoy the weekend. So hopefully <laughs> we get out and do something this weekend. I don't know. I don't see anybody. Where is everybody at? Maybe they're back there by the house. But until then, bag family, stay positive. Stay out of trails and uh, flip everything the Western world teaches you. You'll be all right. Love you guys and see you all soon. See, actually, we'll see you Sunday night on our live. Bye, bag family. Love you. Mr. Samuel is impressed with what Rick is wearing today. He likes what Rick has on. Talking about his African attire today. And I'm impressed with it too. He does look nice with it today, I must say. Let's see what he says when he comes up here. Mr. Rick. My king. Mr. Samuel said he's impressed with what you're wearing today. <laughs> he told me, wow, you're African today. I'm like, hey, what other days were you? I was like, wow. If clothes make me African, uh, I'm we like, don't want them clothes. I'm, I'm sad. <laughs> and that's what I was meant to say. I'm like, huh? I'm like, we wear it every now and then. We don't wear it all the time. Yeah. We're working. I mean, I could say, if you're trying to get off the African continent and want to go and stay elsewhere, you ain't ever. Hey. I, mean, I couldn't say it that, but I did. Yeah, I said thank you, though. He likes, he just said he likes that. Oh, yeah. Uh-huh. Oh, well. Did y'all get the cow? Yeah. I see. Did y'all go all the way around or something? I know, because I saw you go that yeah, way. Yeah, it was a little bitty small one. You follow one of the big ones on. Mama. So we had the corner. <laughs> Where's Raheem? I don't even know. You saw the compost? Yeah, tell me. It really looks nice. I told you. And that's what I was saying. Like, you know, the first two at the, at the end down there needs to be empty so we can throw the compost there. And at that turn, we'll push that one and put it here and then put the hay on top of those. But the, when we put too much of the dry stuff on top of the wet stuff, it's hard to turn. Yeah. And that's the only thing I was saying. It's all good. So I think you guys are doing well with it, and I'm really impressed. Yeah, we just got to throw more uh, nitrogen-based manure on there. Yes, and also... We I got enough of carbon in the ground. We need more green. Right. That's what I'm saying. When they get the bad vegetables... Throw it at the, the, the last two, that's what I was saying, yeah. instead of putting it right on top of the one that's already turned. That's good too, but it's, gotta we got to use it though. That's yeah, what I'm saying. Mix so, mix right, I'm saying, when will we be able to use it if we keep putting in the new stuff? It though, you know what I'm yeah, but you want one to be ready, right? If one is ready, we can use or one or two, three, right, whatever. Right. If you constantly put some on it, we won't be able to use it. Yeah, but if you don't, balance is going to be different right you got to keep it balanced 50 percent nitrogen 50 percent carbon mm -hmm. if you say okay i'm done it's going to all turn into carbon no 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 what i'm saying is let's say we got 10 10 boxes nine of them are already brown enough to be put back onto the garden right yeah, you, you shut them up you right them and that's all i was saying right. we you don't want to add that stuff that we the scrapes that we get from the house right. into that because right. that is that finished that's that why off. i said make at least two of the boxes empty not necessarily empty but we can put the scraps in those no, and as they turn we can always add to that and move that one to the next you box you too? understand what i'm saying yeah, I do now. okay so that's the only thing i was saying what's the matter no i'm looking at what my man doing all oh, the water had came loose over there I think he wanna pull, I think he wanna pull the holes and, and i think they pulled it loose yeah well, that's what they were doing, so. It's not designed to be fooling around like that, but they do it. Exactly, sweet daddy. Yeah, we getting it, though. What Nadi, what you got her doing? Nadi's doing I saw her the same over there. thing James doing, nothing. Uh, James has left the premises. He said he's done for work, and he left, guys, and he did not get paid. So he gonna suffer next week, or this weekend, and he, I'm gonna block him out, I'm blocking him. He better not call me saying he needs something. I'm turning my phone off on him. Mm -hmm. 
So is Samuel coming tomorrow to water? He said he don't know yet, because something. He said he wants them to help him get that stump out away from the house so he can, they can burn it. I said, well, actually, I don't know where it is, but. That's what I told him. Well, he said he was sick, so I didn't think he was coming. So. Exactly. So he has to burn. I don't know who. Gonna... I'm leaving with y'all. No, you not. Ain't no room. Uh, he don't know that. I already told him there ain't no room. Yeah. But we are at the end of the day, end of shift, or whatever you want to call it, and we're out. Somebody's texting me. Who broke green? Okay, let me call this and see what this guy's saying. I'll be back. Now.